what is going on what is going on my youtube family today we're over here at independence harley davidson in charlotte and we're about to do a first ride of the fat bob this particular unit is the 114 milwaukee 8 engine it has an engine torque of 118 foot pounds this actual unit has aftermarket reinhardt exhaust on it and we're going to take it for a ride and i'll let you know my thoughts of it Start it up. That exhaust it sounds amazing. All right, let's take this baby for a ride. Right from the beginning, it definitely has a little bit of power. A lot more power than my sports do, I'll tell you that. Let's see how she handles. Now this comes in a 107 engine as well as the 114. I'm riding a 114 today and this is a 2019. Oh boy. It definitely picks up. I have to say just my initial thoughts is it rides smooth and they said I'm gonna want this bike over there at the dealership after riding it and I haven't even been on it for 30 seconds yet and I want this bike let's see what we got here we're gonna take a turn up here just gonna go right around the corner just do a real quick lap so my seating position is really comfortable usually I feel like I'm scrunched up on a lot of different type of bikes, but this one surprisingly feels real comfy. I like um, how I'm sitting kind of low. My legs are bent, but not bent too much. It has forward controls on it. My arms are stretched out in a comfortable position, not too far, but not cramped up like this either. You know, I have back issues, so I love a comfortable riding position and I have to say this baby this baby is definitely comfy let's see how she handles a couple corners the lean angle seems really really good on this bike I know a lot of bikes um, cruisers that I ride I'd be scared I'm gonna scrape the pegs but the lean angle of this one is pretty good has a real good exhaust note that's due to the Reinhardt aftermarket exhaust that's on here all right let's give her a little bit of open it up a little bit see what it does oh yeah it definitely has some power <laughs> it, it is not lacking in power at all that 114 is definitely doing it justice And it handles literally amazing. It, this bike handles amazing. And I like the way that my Sportster handles. But this, the handling of this, it reminds me of a mix between a cruiser and a sports bike. It's like exactly what I want in regards <laughs> to motorcycling. 
it's like right in between my i'd say my r6 and a real powerful sports i mean and a real powerful cruiser i feel like i could spend a whole day on this and have fun with it not get bored at all my tack with my speedometer is very visible it's bright daylight today and i can see it clear as day there's no trouble reading that display at all we'll pull over up here in the parking lot so i can let you take a peek over um show you my favorite part of this bike actually which is the headlight all right i can see myself literally spending hours on this bike see it handles amazing has really good stability it's stable the power is is always there whenever you need it mm, you hit that gas and definitely has power I wasn't that I, I'm gonna be honest I wasn't expecting it to have this much power feels good to actually get out on the bike today too um, probably will ride the Harley later as well take Harley out for a quick spin um, today was the first day up here doing photos at the dealership and this is one of many to come first rides of course since this is the first first ride video you know it may be a little rough around the edges we'll get better as we go but my goal is to show everyone every Harley Davidson there is so that that way everyone can make their decisions on what type of Harley they want to ride because I feel like everyone can ride a harley there's one for all of you now as everyone knows my background is sports bike riding that's what i learned on that's what i've always had now i have the harley and just from my background i'd have to say that my sportster i like it because it's really really small this bike is not a large bike it's small and comfortable but it has a much more sporty ride than my Sportster. So if you're used to sports bikes or something of that sort, you definitely want to come out and test ride the Fat Bob. I think you'll like it. It's an amazing machine. It has power, it has the looks. Everything about this bike just screams sexiness, you know? Now I'm gonna pull up here and show you what I mean by how sexy she is. Let's take a look. All right, we'll do a quick little, just show you what she looks like with the light on. <laughs> but look at that. That bike is just hands down sexy. Doesn't get much sexier than that, I'd say. Um, has the, looks like almost like a step up seat, the LED headlight. It doesn't look like your typical Harley, but that's the thing. All bikes need innovation at some point and this is innovation it's innovative it's a beautiful Harley Davidson it gives you something different look at that exhaust look at that exhaust that that exhaust is amazing but let me get the bike back to the dealership so if you're in the Charlotte area make sure you swing by Independence Harley Davidson right here off independence um and take this baby for a test ride i feel like everybody who rides motorcycles need to take a ride on the fat bob i like the name too the fat bob but it's your boy infinite rider signing out pulling back up to the dealership I'm going to cry on the way home because <laughs> I wish I was taking this puppy home with me. But make sure you hit that subscribe button, like and comment below, and I will see you in the next one. All right. They're pulling the bikes in. Make sure y'all come check them out. Peace.